every living dragon, Tymac the last dragon, and all the grandmasters. In, in 1971, Bruce Lee told me that I was the Black Dragon. In 1973, I started making films as the character of the Black Dragon. Well, it's, it's been a long time, 1973. I've had an opportunity to work with Cynthia Rothrock, and Don Wilson. It's been uh, quite an interesting journey. But as we get older, we want to make sure that our legacy continues. And I'd like to take this opportunity to pass the mantle and the title of Black Dragon to Michael Jai White. You're seeing my heroes right here with me. Um, what Sensei Jerry Chisholm said is so, so, so apropos, so, so um, true in the fact that um, our images, our images mean a great deal. And this medium that I've been so lucky to be a part of is a part of what uh, brought me here. What you're seeing, these are, these are my heroes. This, now understand, it's, it's sometimes it's difficult for me um, I, I, to be on the, <coughs> excuse me, on the receiving end. I, if you bring me a sandwich, I'm overwhelmed. <laughs> and to, absorb what's happening today is just, this is beyond my wildest dreams. I'm, I become that kid that came to the theater and saw the image of this man right here that inspired me. And I said, I want to be like that. I want to be like that. I saw this man in the closest thing to a superhero I've ever seen in my life at the time, on film at the Studio Cinema Theater as a child. I think it was about probably 78, 79. And I watched The Black Dragon. I saw this image and I, was, I saw every screening of that movie till it left the theater. Every single screening. I started finding who I was in those images. I saw that image of this man who inspires me today. I saw the images of Fred the Hammer Williams who inspires me still to this day in all his glory and power. And I said, I want to be like that. I saw Cynthia Rothrock when I was, uh, I think it was, Early 80s, I was on my own. I've been on my own since I was 14. Uh, and Eric Chen, who was a big brother of mine, brought me to see Fu Chao Pai at, 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 at I think it was City College. And I saw you do the double hooks. And that inspired me to do Chinese martial arts. When I saw Ron Van Cleef, when I was youngster and then I found out there was a guy in my neighborhood named Tonka Ramos who was connected with his system, Chinese Goju. Goju became part of the map for me and I started training because of this man. This man was on my wall. His, his beautiful image 
in a, in a low kung fu stance in this beautiful rendition of his, his garb. I had that on my wand. I said, I want to be like that. Don the Dragon Wilson, wonder, even though you didn't know, well, I would, you, you were a hero of mine. I saw you fight. I saw, uh, I was in an early movie of yours as, as a day player. I trained right next to you a number of times you didn't know, but I was there uh, several times, and you've been the most, one of the most honest and humble people I've ever seen. And as a fighter, as a, a person who has fought and did movies and was the nicest, <laughs> one of the nicest human beings, and he continues to be. And I said, I want to be like that. Okay, I mean, and then Timac. I was around with Jerry, Jerry could attest, it. Jerry Fontanez could attest to this. When you first came out, I was so proud. I was so proud. And, and I studied and I watched and I said, this powerful, beautiful man, this martial artist, has, has come about in this age of this, you know, martial arts movies and stuff. And, and I said, I, I have to learn this, in, this industry because I saw the, your, your image and not be, I, I was like, how is the world not going after this? And I said, okay, we gotta learn this. We gotta learn it from the business side as well, and you inspired me to do that. And that's why even when I did plays, I, I you know, <laughs> I want you to come out and do the plays with me because you were an inspiration and continue to be that. Yeah. These people, I mean, for me to see this, I had to get, get myself together and say, wait a minute, you're gonna bestow this title, the title that brought me here? Upon me, oh, and, you know. To I, I'm glad I had the time from that beautiful drum selection that you beautiful. That's right. And I'm saying right. this is. <laughs> but I would share this with all of you because all of you are part of making me. You you are inspiring me. You continue to inspire me. Even to this day, I I want to be doing the same thing. When yeah, yeah, and I, I gotta say, this is something that I feel we all we all should celebrate together because this you are my community. You inspire. That's right. There's nothing in Hollywood that they can give me that will fulfill me anywhere near the way that this fulfills me. Because this, this is that kid in the movie theater standing here, right? Okay, and it's a testament to what we, we do as far as martial artists. And from belt level, from white belt to yellow belt, we overcome obstacles. And what is life if not overcoming obstacles? Mm -hmm. And we are taught the mechanisms to succeed in life. This is a celebration of that. To celebrate me is to celebrate yourselves. Mm. And man, I, I, there's no greater family that I can celebrate this with. Thank you Thank so you, much. Cynthia, sign. Dragons are passing the mantle.